It has been such an honor stepping into the iconic role of Ariel. After months of teasing and the odd false start, the stars of Disney's The Little Mermaid took the stage at the 95th Oscars ceremony to share a new look at the upcoming live-action film, the hotly anticipated live-action remake of the classic 1989 animated film. For 100 years, the Walt Disney Company has produced some of the best heroes, villains and stories of all time, and this amazing legacy would not be complete without The Little Mermaid, Melissa McCarthy, who stars as Ursula, said. It has been such an honor stepping into the iconic role of Ariel, her co-star Halle Bailey added. It's been an extraordinary experience, a dream come true for me. The first official teaser trailer for the remake, showcased at the 2022 D23 Expo back in September, premiered Bailey as Ariel, showing her swimming underwater as she sang some of the lyrics to the iconic song, Part of Your World. Bailey is making history as the first black actress to play Ariel. The singer, one half of the singing group Chloe X. Halley, was cast in the role in July 2019. While the announcement of her casting is groundbreaking and was met with supportive feedback, it also brought in some backlash. As a black person, you just expect it and it's not really a shock anymore, she said in an interview with The Face magazine. Yet the 22-year-old actress has expressed a stronger emotional response to the positive feedback. I was crying all night for two days, just staring at them in disbelief, she said, referring to the videos of young black girls reacting to the first teaser trailer of the upcoming film. It just makes me feel more grateful for where I am. Last month, Disney dropped a snippet of villain Ursula's terrifying laugh after fans were distressed that the trailer didn't drop during the Super Bowl, as they had predicted. The new trailer was shared to Disney's social media accounts just seconds later, teasing, watch and you'll see, someday I'll be, part of your world. The new two-minute trailer opens with a harrowing storm that throws the swashbuckling Prince Eric overboard, putting into motion Ariel's infatuation with the land-dwelling prince. As he's tossed from his burning ship into the dark depths of the ocean, Ariel is seen rescuing him and taking him to safety on the beach. Remaining faithful to the original Disney classic, Ariel is seen gazing tenderly at him on the beach before being frightened away by his men coming to find him. The trailer also offered a first glimpse of Javier Bardem as King Triton with a magnificent beard and chest plate. You broke the rules, you went to the above world, he tells his daughter, adding, this obsession with humans has to stop. More of Melissa McCarthy's Ursula is also shown, with the actress both looking and sounding unrecognizable as she strikes a bargain with the mermaid for her voice in terrifying scenes. Scuttle, voiced by Aquafina, Sebastian, voiced by David Diggs and Flounder, voiced by Jacob Tremblay, are all present and correct as well, offering their support as Ariel's companions after she gained her legs. Although new characters were missing from the trailer, which include Queen Selena, played by Noma Dumezweni, Perla played by Lorena Andrea, and Karina played by Kaisa Mohamar, Vanessa will be played by Jessica Alexander, Rosa will be played by Emily Coates as well as Bridgerton star Simone Ashley, who has been cast as Indira. We'll probably have to wait nearer the time of the release of the movie to see if Disney share any character photos of these actors. It's also been revealed that the original voice behind Ariel, Jodie Benson, will be making a cameo in the new live-action remake. The new movie musical is directed by Rob Marshall, famed for directing Mary Poppins' Returns, Pirates of the Caribbean and Chicago, to mention a few. The musical will also feature four new original songs written by Alan Menken, who won two Oscars for the music of the original film, and, Hamilton creator, Lin-Manuel Miranda famed for this work on Disney's Moana, Encanto and Mary Poppins Returns, has co-wrote new songs for the 2023 remake. Speaking about the new songs, Miranda has said, we wrote three or four new original tunes, replacing none of the ones you like. All of those are in, under the sea and part of your world. There's no bigger Little Mermaid fan than me, he added. There's also a rumor that Lin-Manuel Miranda will be playing a character in the new live-action remake, Chef Lewis, but we will have to wait and see if this is true, as nothing has been officially released yet. The Little Mermaid will be released worldwide this year on May 26th.